So you might be trying to figure out how you can turn off your voicemail on your particular iPhone. Now, there's a couple of ways to do this. There's not just one specific way of going about doing this. The first thing I'd recommend doing is I probably wouldn't recommend turning off your voicemail. I think there's probably people who need to contact you or whatever. And it's probably best to kind of keep it on if I'm being completely honest. Realistically speaking, if you want to go through and just like completely turn off voicemail, an option that you do kind of have though is that you can always go through and you can essentially just, you know, turn off notifications of voicemails or missed calls in general. And what you can do here is you can make your way over to your settings application. And you can go into your notification panel, which is right here. You can then scroll down until you see your phone panel. So you can scroll down until you see that you know, phone option, which is right here, not this one, and this one. And what you can do here is you can basically just either allow notifications or you can just turn off notifications of this particular app. So this will mean that if anybody's contacting you or if anybody's leaving a voicemail, you will not be notified of it. You will still see it if you come into here into the voicemail, but that is the first option. Now, if you actually want to completely turn off voicemail, it really depends on your cell provider meaning that if your cell provider allows you to go and turn off your voicemail, what you can do there is you can call your cell phone provider. So whether it's AT&T or Verizon or T-Mobile, whoever you have, you want to go ahead and contact your particular carrier. And then what you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and basically, you know, let them know, hey, I want to go and cancel. I want to just turn off my voicemail. I don't want to keep it on anymore. And from there, what they're going to be, um, you know, be able to do is they're going to be able to turn off their voicemail on their end if your cell phone plan provides for it. So, those are just a couple of different ways to do it. Again, it's not just there's not just one way of specifically doing it, but those are basically the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.